Welcome to Resolution Farming. Today's tutorial focuses on the tasking function of our software. This video will explain how to view, filter and print tasks, as well as create tasks, save them as records and push records to a task. We will mainly use the web version to demonstrate these functions on our tutorial today, but tasking is equally as usable while out on the farm on the app on your phone. Before watching this tutorial, we recommend you watch our video on settings via the link below, as it contains important information on adjusting permissions to ensure your farm privacy and who can view each of your tasks. For example, while farm managers would want to be able to view and edit all tasks, we may only want staff members or contractors to view tasks and information directly related to them. To begin, let's create a task. Go to the Tasking tab beside Records at the top of your screen. Either click on the Tasking drop-down from the Quick Add function or the smaller green plus within the Tasking menu. You will then be prompted to add instructions. I'm assigning a task to Paul to fix a broken trough down in Franks. You can assign a task for one person or numerous staff members. We'd select his name from the drop-down menu, then select a due date, and click on relevant paddocks on the map for reference. We might then attach a photo of the broken trough so Paul knows exactly what he's dealing with at the job at hand. Hit save and Paul will receive an email notification with a link that will directly take him to the task on the resolution website. Now let's view and filter our tasks. At the left top corner of the tasking tab, you will see the options of viewing uncompleted, complete or all tasks. As you can see, uncompleted tasks are white while completed tasks are shaded green for your clarity. To filter tasks beyond this, we have three options, date, person or text search. By clicking on the filter by person toggle, you will have the option of selecting one or multiple people for who the task was created by, assigned to, or completed by. We're wanting to find a task assigned to Henry for applying some fart to the farm. So we would click on the assigned to option under Henry's name. Click done and we can now view all tasks assigned to Henry. We can also view the spreadsheet attached to the task with our fart record for reference, as well as relevant paddocks, which we can see are highlighted on the map. At the right top corner of this task, we have the options to complete task, print task, or edit. Printing tasks is a great feature of Resolution, particularly for contractors coming onto the farm. Under this feature, for our specific purposes, we want to include name and effective area on our printout, and download it as a PDF. For printing purposes, we also want it in black and white, and in map view rather than satellite. When you hit print, Resolution will download a PDF including task instructions, task number, effective area, paddock names and map, highlighting the relevant paddocks to be printed. We click back on Henry's task, close the filter and now we are going to filter by date. You will have the options of filtering by due date, completed or created. I want to view a task that I know I completed sometime in the last fortnight, so I would select this from the drop down menu. Here we can view a task I completed, including highlighted paddocks. We can also click to see an image I attached while out on the farm after completing the task. Once again, closing the filter, we can now filter by entering the symbol text in the search tab. By typing lambs, for example, I can see the two records associated with this keyword. We can also save tasks to our records. Going into the task that I received and completed earlier, you can see beside complete task, there's the option to create record. Clicking on this, all of the information in our task is pushed to a record format. You might like to edit the text, as I am here, before being prompted to select relevant tags. In this case, the relevant tags would be names and perhaps movement. Hit save and you will now see that the completed task has been saved on our farm timeline as a record. We may also want to flip this and push a record to task. 
If we scroll down to our relevant record and then hit view, by clicking on the edit option on the record, you will see the option to create task. Hit this and you will be prompted to create a task with instructions, assignees, due date and relevant paddocks and documents as we've looked at before. Hit save and like creating a task, an email notification will once again be sent to your assigned staff members and a task will appear as uncompleted on the tasking homepage. Thanks for watching and we hope you found this video useful. To keep up to date with news and new videos, be sure to follow us on our Facebook page and turn post notifications on, as well as subscribe to our YouTube channel. To get in touch, contact support at resolutionapp.co.nz.